Line 28. Et genus in visum, et rapti ganimides honores. I will give a word per word dictionary entry and a translation. I will then parse, reorder the sentence, translate, and give my lines so far. Et genus in visum, et. Et. Copulative conjunction, and, and. Genus, genus, generous, third declension neuter, nominative singular, the race, the race. In visum, in visus, in visa, in visum, nominative singular masculine, perfect passive participle of video, hated, hated. At, copulative conjunction, and, and, et genus in visum et, and the race hated, and. Rapti ganimides honores. Rapti, raptus, rapta, raptum, genitive singular masculine, perfect passive participle of rapio, stolen or carried, or even seduced or ravaged. I chose seized. Ganymedes. 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 Genitive singular masculine. Ganymede. Ganymede. Honores. Honor. Honores. Masculine third declension. Nominative plural. Honors. As in a poster office or offering honors. Rapti Ganymedes honores seized Ganymede honors. Et genus in visum et Rapti Ganymedes honores. Et and it joins genus and eudicium. Genus means the race. It refers to the Trojan race. It is joined to Eudicium by et. In visum means hated. It is used adjectively to qualify genus. Et means and. Rapti means seized. It agrees with Ganymedes. Uh, if you wanted to use a relative clause, Ganymede, who was seized. Ganymedes is Ganymede. It's the objective genitive after honores. And honores is honors joined to genus by et. If I had to reorder the words, I would have et in visum genus et honores rapti ganymedes. And hated the race and honors seized ganymede. Line 28. Et genus in visum et rapti ganymedes honores. And the hated race and honors of seized Ganymede. All the lines so far. Id meturens veritas quae memor Saturnia belli, prima quod ad troiam procaris geserat argus. Nectum etiam causae erarum saeruque dolores exciderant animo. Mane alta menta repostum iudicum paredis spretae quae eurea for my et genus in visum et rapti genimadis honores. Saturn's daughter, fearing that, and mindful of the ancient war, which, for most, she had waged at Troy for dear Argus, nor yet even had the causes of her anger and cruel griefs fallen from her mind, reserved deep in her mind remains the judgment of Paris and the injury of slighted beauty and the hated race and honors of seized Ganymede. <laughs>